We just drove nine hours, nine hours, to get to Horseshoe Bend in Page, Arizona. excited we also have been driving since 10 p.m. last night it is like 6 30 in the morning 7 o'clock I'm so excited it is freezing though like I'm so cold so we're gonna explore page a little bit but first stop horseshoe bed if I could say that right horseshoe bed all right let's go you get too close Somebody beat us to it. One. There are already a few people here, but luckily it's not that crowded. I'm just seeing everybody. I'm like, wow, oh, what's on the because we can't see what's on the other side yet. The what? Corn nuts. <laughs> what? We're about to see like this. Epic sight, and you know, all I can think about are the corn nuts. Yeah, I need, hungry. I need breakfast. Yes, it's the most important meal, they say. Made of truth. <laughs> I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend Living life on the edge over here? How's the view over there? We just took like a bunch of photos. And you know what I know why? It's because we keep doing this thing where we're like, oh, we'll come back another time. No, it's 2020. We don't know when we're gonna come back. We don't know if this place will exist after 2020. You know, like, 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 like we, can't, we can't take no risks around here. So we're taking so many pictures, like so many. I'm gonna give a little quick little room tour of our messy room because we've already messed it up. Listen, we came here, we slept for an hour and a half. We had to wake up from that sleep after a nine hour drive, okay? Like, we're a little exhausted, okay? But, this is the basic AS room we're staying in. TV, microwave we're never gonna use, fridge we're only using because we need to get our uh, energy drinks cold. AC, bathroom area. God, we are just, we destroy this place in just like two seconds. Anyway, the point is, they give you the option to purchase any of the items in this room so that we won't steal it. Now I have a question. One of the items on this is alarm clocks. Peru, have you seen an alarm clock? They don't have alarm clocks in here. So if I wanted to buy an alarm clock, it would be $25. Seems that somebody else already bought it. Are we gonna go to Safeway or are we just, uh, what are we doing? Yeah, we should come to Safeway. We gotta get snacks. You know, it's actually not as hot as I thought it was gonna be. It's a little windy too, which worries me a little. But it's okay. It's fine. We're gonna make the most of it. So we got to Antelope at Marine Point. So basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our little paddle boards, which are right there in those backpacks, 
and we're going to unload them into the river, into, I'm sorry, Lake Powell, not the river, into Lake Powell, so we can go paddle, paddle boarding in the little canyons. It'll be really cool. Um, but from now on, you're not going to see it on this camera. You're going to see it on my GoPro and my cell phone because I don't want to lose this camera inside the water. All right, bye. All right, so we are currently on the lake and we're trying to figure out where to go. We're not really sure where to go, but um, it's nice. We're just following all the kayakers. I'm starting to lose my friend and I'm bending down to this because my GoPro is attached to the paddleboard. Uh, yeah, so I gotta go catch up with my friend. Bye. here so we made it to the end and it's like super muddy the water's kind of gross but this is where people usually go hiking we didn't really bring hiking stuff because we just didn't plan on hiking <sighs> but we might as well see it Ooh. Don't don't judge. One hundred calories. My feet are getting a nice little mud spa. Good, good. Good for my ankle. It's good for your ankle. I like to believe that. I like <laughs> to believe so. It's it's healing my ankle. It's how the Native Americans did it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, little mud baths. Yeah. How's our sandwich hanging out? You know. You know. Soggy? Yeah. Oh, good. All right, we just ate, so now we're headed back because we got to beat the fact that the sun is going down. It took us almost two hours to get here. So, time to get going. We missed sunset, but it's okay. We beat the crowd somehow, miraculously. We came really late to Lake Powell, thinking we were so late, we're gonna miss everything, but no, we missed the crowds. Everyone left, and it was just us, and it was just, it was beautiful, it was silent, and the waves aren't even as bad as when we first got here, like the wind has calmed down. It's really worth the nine hour drive, it really was. I'm losing my friend. <laughs> 